I hate your deck. Wizards of the West Coast. Tapping out and slinging spells. Shenanigans will ensue in this No Holds Barred EDH show. Each month, we'll highlight a new commander deck that you get to see pop off in a glorious fashion. Now meet our players for this month's game. What's going on, y'all? It's your boy Joe Johnson, aka Black Nito, coming back with Akiri, Fearless Voyager from episode one. I gotta get my revenge. Now Jeremy ain't here, so uh, ain't no haters to stop me. What's up, it's your boy Lynch. Today I'm playing Phoenix, God of Deception. So I'm trying to mill all the players out so they have no cards left in their library to attack me with. And as always, I'm just here to make sure I have fun playing Commander with my friends at the table. I'm David, back again. I'm looking nice today because I got a date with Victory. My commander today is Anwan the Ruin Thief. I put a bunch of little rogues out, poke these guys, and make them mill their whole decks. Hi, my name is Becky Bell. I go by Becky Bear. Uh, I am playing Rael the Everwise, and I'm trying to discard some cards, but also get that many cards back, go through my deck, and find one of the many combos within it. I hate your deck. All right, guys, let's roll up to see who gets the high roll goes roll first. Up. I got two. Seven. Four. Four. It was a one, so I got a five. So okay. it looks like Joe gets high roll. Draw a card. Turn one. Let's do this. I'm going to play a spectator seating. Comes in untapped, unless I control two, or I have two or more opponents, which I do. And then let's tap one for a shadow spear. Oh. Mm -hmm. Coming out the gate. Dirty. Let's do this. Dirty. Last turn. All right, I draw for turn. I'm going to play a watery grave tapped and pass. Cool, I will go ahead and draw. Uh, I'm gonna start off with a Temple of Epiphany. Uh, when it enters the battlefield, I will scry one. I'm gonna go ahead and bottom that card. And then I will cast Mana Crypt. Uh, at the beginning of my upkeep, I'm gonna flip a coin, and if I lose the flip, it will deal three damage to me. It can tap and add two mana. I'm gonna use that ability right now. Add two mana to my mana pool and play a Fire Diamond tapped. Spicy. Uh, it's just a red mana rock that enters tapped, but I gotta gotta have mana to do what I want to do. So pass the turn. Makes well, sense. I'll draw, and you know I'll do some spicy things too. I'll play an island, and I'll brainstorm. I'm gonna draw three cards and then put two cards from my hand on top of my library in any order. So one, two, three. I will put these two back. Exactly like this, and I'll pass. See if I can keep up. Straw, I will play an Inventor's Fair for my land for turn. Spicy. I'll tap that for a Voltaic Key. Very spicy. <clears throat> old, old border. Old border. And then I'm I'll, all about old borders, love old borders. <laughs> uh, then I'll play a Mox Opal for free, and uh, I can actually use it because I have Metalcraft. Actually, it's not free, it costs zero. It costs zero, you're right, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> I'll pass. Yeah, nice turn, Joe. Hey, I try to do what I can. I felt uh, like mine was pretty good, but Joe just has to go and show me up a little bit. Right? I'll draw for turn. I'm going to play a swamp. I'm going to tap both to float two mana, and I'll cast Mind Crank. Whenever an opponent loses life, that player puts that many cards from the top of his or her library into his or her graveyard, and I will pass. Uh-oh. Oh. Mana Crypts don't hurt me now. Odds is winning the flip, evens is losing the flip. Okay, yep. Sure. Ooh, that works. I like it. It is even, so I lose the flip. I will take three damage. Point and laugh, oh. boys. <laughs> it's up and down. Okay. Oh, it's up and down. Oh. oh yeah, no wow. And then, And yep. then I'm milling three. Yep, one. Uh, Mox Diamond, a Mountain, and an Echo of Eons. And then I will draw for my turn. Hey, at least I'm milling. I'm still <laughs> yeah, you, you <laughs> I, I had a very humble turn, you know too. <laughs> but at least my deck is starting to work a little bit. You're doing what you do. Well, I can get Sir Conrad out. Oh, is he in there? He is. Of okay. course he is. Of course, of course. Anytime you can, run it. Well, I'm going to go ahead and play a Wooded Foothills. Uh, sack it. Lose life. Oh. That way. There okay. you go. Does mill. that happen and before gonna, this? Yeah, yeah, you're going to pay the life and then mill. Yeah, yeah sorry. Mill the, the other fetch nice land. Though. Another fetch land. Those fetches. Fetchity fetch. Let's go ahead and get an island. Uh oh. Not blue enough. players, you gotta be careful about them, even though I'm blue too, and you're blue. Yeah, everybody's blue. What, what, what is this? You're in a pod Y'all surround, surrounding me now, right now. I don't know what to do. He hates blue. Yeah, yeah, no, it's okay. It's I normally do too. Don't think of it as competitive. Think of it as casually hard. <laughs> mm, okay, okay, okay. Hey, go, David. 
I like it. Casually, casually hard. hard. Casually hard. I'm just getting ready to tap that mana crypt. Oh, play Mind Stone. Uh oh. Uh, it taps for more mana, but also can be sacrificed for a card later. Uh, I will tap the Mind Stone and the Fire Diamond to play Dockside Extortionist. Oh. Mm -hmm. uh, I, like I will this. be making four treasures. Yeah. All right, and I do have uh, four of those. Perfect. Nice foily one, too. Okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and sacrifice one of the treasure tokens, tap these two, and go ahead and play Rael the Everwise. Uh, Rael says that uh, she gets plus one, plus oh for each instant or sorcery card in my graveyard. Currently, that is one. Uh, so she is a one three. And whenever I discard one or more cards for the first time each turn, I will draw that many cards. Okay. And uh, I think that that is gonna wrap up my turn. You know, I forgot to bring my lightning bolt, but it'll be <laughs> fine. I'll draw, I will play a swamp, and you know, I'll just put a little Naga Rogue. It can't be blocked, a little, little one two sneaky boy. Okay. And I'll pass. Okay. Um, cat Limited All Star right there. Yeah. All right, untap. Uh, begin my upkeep. If I control three or more artifacts, I will gain a life, so I do. Boop. Now you're the first one to die. Hit it a race. What? <laughs> <laughs> first to gain life, first to die. <laughs> my rogue's gonna poke you. I see it, but uh, He's, uh poking you. I, I like that that uh the little pirate you got over there. Oh, thanks. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, oh. play my little pirate as well. Oh, wow, you're so smart than mine because you also get mine. So okay, yeah, so that's, that's gonna be three, quite a four, few. Five, six, seven, seven, seven. All right, I should have waited to play mine. <laughs> And so you got a treasure. Dockside Extortion is going to get me seven of these little spicy boys. All right, so let's start off by using three of them to cast my commander, Akiri, Fearless Voyager. So bad um, in this game. <laughs> whenever I attack with one or more equipped creatures, I can draw a card. I can pay one and unattach equipment from a creature I control. If I do tap that creature, it gains indestructible until end of turn. So I'm going to lose two That's more treasures. That's nobody's got to stick together. <laughs> And I'm gonna equip the Shadow Spear to a carry. And I got three left. I'll go ahead and use these treasures and tap the Mox Opal for a Ghostly Prison. Uh, you know, Joe, that's ugly for our state. <laughs> it's ugly because it's very good. <laughs> I will play a Command Tower, which will give me one color of anything, if it mattered. It doesn't right now. I will tap three, and I will cast a Sphinx's Toolage. Whenever I draw a card, target opponent puts the top two cards of his or her library into the graveyard. If they both share a non-land card, share a color, repeat the process. So I will pass. Do you have Painter 7 in there? No. You probably do. No, because it was in my Conrad and I- Oh, was right. In... Never mind. All right, uh, odds I win, evens I lose for Mana Crypt. I lose again. I will mill three and take three. Boop, boop, boop. Uh, Talisman of Creativity, Windfall, and Niv Mizzet <laughs> oh. That makes Rayo bigger. Uh, a draw for turn. What's she going to do now? Uh, let's start with the Shivan Reef. Humble beginnings. Nice old school border. Let's go ahead. If it's going to hurt me, it might as well tap for mana for me. You know? <laughs> yeah. Might as well use it. Exactly. Uh, and the island, I will go ahead and cast Thirst for Meaning. I will draw three cards, then discard two cards, unless I discard an enchantment card. Discard a mountain and it is a guild gate. This will trigger Rael. Uh, since I discarded two cards and it's the first time I've discarded this turn, I will draw two cards. Nice. That's some value. That's value spicy. 10. Get that value, Becky. This is the way. <laughs> this is the way. Uh, let's go ahead, tap the Mind Stone and the Temple of Epiphany for blue and cast a Merfolk Looter. It is a draw a card and then choose to discard a card. Choose a card and discard it. I see the synergy with your commander. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm trying to just like go through my deck as quickly as possible. So, uh, and maybe you two can help me with that a little bit. We probably will. <laughs> <laughs> Keep rolling even. <laughs> sounds yeah, like, that's true. Sounds like I'll help you with that. Uh, and then I'm going to go ahead and pass the turn. I'll untap, I'll upkeep, and I will draw, and I will play a swamp for the turn. Now, I'm gonna get another little merfolk rogue this time, another little poker. My creature can't be blocked. I'm gonna go ahead and move to combat, and you're looking scary, and you're looking scary. So my, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna attack you. Okay. 
with a little, just one too little rogue boy. Take one. This is also going to trigger mine crank. Yes. I will mill Magus of the wheel. All right. Oh, my you, got a lot wheel of wheels. you got a lot of your wheels happening. <gasps> you got wheel fortune in there? Yeah. I'll pack some. <laughs> All right. Untap. I'll gain a life on my upkeep. Draw. Too bad it's not gain a life mill, you know. I know. That would be, <laughs> that'd be terrifying. There should be what card that says that. Yeah, a reverse mind crank. <laughs> that would be so bad. <laughs> I would hate that. Heart crank. It's Wizards, heart get on crank. that. Give us a, a opposite of mind crank. All right, so I'm gonna go to combat and Lynch. I'm gonna swing at you with my Kiri. Four, three. Oh, no, for four actually. One, two, three, four. Down with Dang. the mind crank. Two, three, four. <laughs> that is uh, play removal at this point. Is what you're to do? <laughs> exactly. Uh, on her on her uh, trigger after she swings, she is equipped. So I will draw a card. That is for commander. I don't know if you want to mark that. Oh yeah. <laughs> Let's not forget commander damage. <laughs> Not like I didn't take 14 of that last time we played. <laughs> and then my second man, I'm going to play a plane for my land for turn. I'm going to tap four for a Court of Grace. When it enters the battlefield, you become the monarch. At the beginning of your upkeep, create a 1-1 one, one white spirit creature token with flying. If you are the monarch, you create a 4-4 four, four angel with flying. So I'll go ahead and get that crown. Bam. Let's see. I know I don't have a game nice crown. I can't just. <laughs> <laughs> In my turn, and I'm going to draw a card. I will untap my three little lands compared to what you got going on over there. I got three lands too. Uh, and rocks. I will draw <laughs> for turn. Uh, because I drew a card, this will trigger. I will mill Joe yes. for two cards. <laughs> Excellent. Uh, Steel Shaper's Gift and Ancient Den. Okay. Now I will play a Swamp for turn. I'm extremely disappointed with what's going on in my head right now. <laughs> Damnation? I probably should just pass. On your end step, I'm going to use one of my treasures to make a blue. And you know what? I can play a mill deck too. I'm going to cast Thought Scour. I'm going to target uh, you, Michael. What does that do? Uh, you will mill two cards, and then I'm going to draw a card. Okay. So I milled two? Yep. I milled two. I milled Sublime Empathy and Swamp. And now I believe it's your turn. And I draw off of Thought Scour, and then it's my turn. Yeah. Odds I win, evens I lose. And I've rolled sixes every time. Okay, there you finally go. it's You're not safe. hurting me. Nice. <laughs> All right, and then I'm gonna drop a turn. Go ahead and play an island as my land for turn. I've got a lot of things. It's just deciding exactly how I want to go about using the sequencing. Them. Wheel. Yeah, exactly. Wheel. 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 <laughs> Don't. I mean, it Please. seems like a lot of people Stop. have cards in hand, so like Don't. that might be kind of good. But I think I want to, especially the, the only one. The fact that one... Joe's asking for it is a problem. Yeah, I just agree. Uh, I'm gonna sacrifice Crank. two treasure, one for a red, one for a blue. Uh, another red and a blue. Is it? Uh, tap the mana crypt for another two generic, and go ahead and cast Niv Mizzet the Firemind. Ooh. Uh, Niv Mizzet is a four-four flyer and says whenever I draw a card, Niv Mizzet the Firemind deals one damage to any target. I can tap Niv Mizzet to draw a card. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and tap. Murphal Cluder to draw oh, a card. In response, I'm yeah. going to pay for Notion Thief. Oh. So instead of you drawing, I'm going to draw. I was waiting for that. <laughs> I couldn't figure it out if it worked last time when you drew because it wasn't a draw step. So I didn't, right? It wouldn't have worked on your end step last time, right? I don't think so. No. Yeah, I had to wait for it. Yeah. All right, cool. I have all a right. creature. And then I discard a card. You take all of my draws, correct? If your opponent would draw a card except for the first one here, she draws in each of his draw steps. Instead, that player skips that draw and you draw a card. Wow. So you're gonna draw off of my Rael trigger as well? I think so. Yep, go ahead. Yay, I need cards. <laughs> <laughs> I got flooded bad. <laughs> I had like all land in my hand. That's such a good card. <laughs> but I still get the first draw. You get your first, get the first draw. First draw every turn. Every turn. Okay, okay. Yeah. Just not this turn anymore. Okay, uh, then I'm gonna go ahead and pass to you. Never mind. don't wheel, don't wheel, don't wheel. I'll draw for the turn yeah, and I will play do a it. Swamp. And I do have four mana, so you know what that means? It's Anawan time, baby. Oh, prime time Anawan. Other rogues I control get plus one, plus one. Whenever one or more rogues I control deals combat damage to a player, that player mills a card for each one damage dealt to them. If the, pl if the player mills at least one creature card this way, I get to draw a card. Mr. Joe. You have a ghostly prison. Yeah. yeah. And that can't attack. <laughs> and you can't attack. Unfortunately. Good to know, though, that you wanted to attack me. I want that miner. 
Miss Becky. I forgot mm-hmm. this trigger. So, mm-hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and attack you with a 2 3 and a 2 2. So, Not me again. Well, I don't wanna mill Mike. Mike's gonna mill me. I'm gonna mill Mike. It's just they gonna both be a can't bad be thing. They both They're be both can't be blocked. One is a 1 1, though. One is a two two. They have plus one plus one because they're both rogy boys. Then I am taking four. It looks like. Yes, they are. And because you take four, mind crane triggers. Sounds good. Cascade bluffs, days undoing, brainstorm, and chromox. And then you mill four, four, and a one. Oh wow. Uh, command tower, arcane lighthouse, sky diamond. Creature, creature? And cathartic reunion. Nope. Uh, not a creature. I don't play a lot of those, man. <laughs> no, there's not a lot in there. <laughs> well, that's You're going to have to mill somebody else if you want creatures milled. <laughs> I'm done. I'll pass. All right. Let's untap. Uh, upkeep, I will gain a life. And uh, Court of Grace, I will put out a 4-4 angel. I am not winning this game. Man, if they're going to team up, maybe you and I should team up. No. Who's you and I? Me and you? I'll team up with anybody that isn't the person attacking me. <laughs> oh, well. I'm less inclined to uh, go with the person who has a ghostly prison, but that's something I don't see on your show a whole lot, is uh, people doing the whole diplomacy thing, but... Because usually too many people are winning, so it's like a problem. It's <laughs> so like, no you all are threats. <laughs> that's fair. It's that's totally fair. okay having an alliance as long as it works. <laughs> It usually doesn't. Uh, I'm going to play an Ancient Tomb for my land for turn, which is going to trigger Mind Crank over there. Let's go ahead and I will take the two damage from the Mind Crank. Mill two. Or mill two. And the, oh, Sword of Truth and Justice. Mm. And a Great Furnace. Boo. That's fine. And I'm going to play a Skyclave Relic kicked. Ooh, uh, Skyclave that. Relic enters the battlefield. If it was kicked, create two tapped tokens that are copies of Skyclave Relic. Uh, it's indestructible. It can add mana of any one color. Mana rocks. Mana <laughs> rocks. All the rocks. These guys come in tapped. All right. I feel like people are going to be swinging Still better than Dark still it. You have a ghostly prison. Who's I'm, swinging at you? Yeah, you're right. You're right. I don't know about that uh, That notion thief that was going to Do you want me to me kill mad. it? Ooh, yes. Kill it with fire. You're going to kill it right Stop. now? You don't want him to draw if more I'll, cards. If I'll get him on my side, I'll do it. He's not no one's side. On side. I would wait to kill on my turn when I can't draw Look, your we're cards. Both, we're both playing red. They're not. This is, I'm I'm trying to. Look at his board state. Got do four, you want to help him get more four, cards? Four commander damage he's, out right now. He's got I a shadow gonna, sphere, ghostly prison. I will, I will keep He's it. creating four, four angels. I will keep Look, it going. You just don't, you just don't want to take this pain. Yeah. If you do it, it's smarter play to do it on my end. I know it is. I know it is. But also. He just turbo wins. Look, I'm it only is attacking me. you. It's not personal. It's strictly business. <laughs> it's, I just, I definitely, it's, I don't think it's a smart play to do it on his turn. <laughs> it's, yeah. I'll say that. If you're going to do will, it, it's will, smarter will, to do it on my turn. I will try protect you by player removal. I am a little too scared of you. Otherwise, I probably would say yes. But yeah, I think I am a little, just a All little right. too afraid Well, I'm not going to put more cards in Lynch's hand, so I will not swing with Kiri. Okay. Uh, but you are, because Monarch trigger. Oh, so uh, if you're gonna do it so you bit. already announced that you're not. I'll <laughs> declare no blockers. Take back this counter. Go to your take, take backs, backs counter. Is, yeah. Okay. Already a take yeah, back this counter. I'll take a take back this counter so I can swing at you. How many take back these counters do we have? Uh, I gotta right. know. Three and you die. If you get three, you're dead. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, going to combat, Lynch. Yes, I will swing at you. Uh, four. I have to draw, One, two, draw a three, card. four. <laughs> so you draw a card. One, two, three, four. I draw a card. And I'll gain four. Another land. Uh, and then I will so go to my end step. I will draw a card from Monarch, but you And I will draw. draw another card. Oh, man, yeah, you should have killed that thing. He's gonna get so many cards. I'm kind of <laughs> thinking about doing it now before he untaps, because I am a little bit afraid of him killing the way that I get rid of it. Yeah. Never mind. I guess so, you can keep the notion, Thief. Okay, so I untap. Yeah. I draw from my turn. Oh, f- hold on. Fuck. <laughs> I'm gonna, m- sorry, this would have yeah. triggered. You draw, you're gonna mill four. Sure, I'll mill four. For the Sphinx's Mother tool age. It's not a May. It says Hammer whenever you draw a card, target opponent puts. Mm. I have already missed it earlier, but I'm going to forgive those ones. But uh, yeah, Smothering Tide, ha- Hammer But design. you forgive nothing now. Uh, yeah, Mistress Workshop. Not, not with that board Ooh. state. And uh, Furry <laughs> Champion. Okay, so now I'll go to my turn. I'll untap my four lands. I will draw for turn. None of this is helpful. How is it not helpful? Because I am I am so far behind and right now. You just now. drew for turn. You milling me again? One, two. Tutelage? You gonna tutelage me again? Sure. 
Sure. I, you know I'm loving this, right? <laughs> Wood of Foothills and Archangel Avison. Okay. Wonderful. Oh, that cost fudge. <laughs> it's just <laughs> not my game today. All right, I will tap one, two, three, four. I'll tap four. I will cast Crypt Guest. That will allow my swamps to tap for both. This is a swamp. Yeah. So I'll go ahead and I'll tap the Watery Grave and I'll cast the Alter Dementia. Which really isn't going to help me right now. <laughs> I mean, it'd be um, nice if you could sacrifice the Notion Thieves. Yeah. Uh, well, is Joe tap? No, he's not tapped out. Oh, you, oh, you want to swing over here? You can't. Go oh, to you prison. Can't. Oh, you can't. Yeah, yeah, I'm in my yeah, little yeah, ivory tower just prison. chilling. <laughs> ghostly prison. All right, You're in prison. I, I pass That's where you are. Do any of us have a way to get rid of ghostly prison? I can firmly say no, and it legally cannot do anything. Untap, I have the mana crypt trigger. Odds I win, evens I lose. Yes. It's a six again. And then uh, Mind Crank. Scalding Tarn, Exotic Orchard, and Mr. Cremora. The fish. The fish. The fish. The mm -hmm. fish. And then I'll draw for turn. This is gonna trigger. Nip miss it, and I will deal one damage to Notion Thief. <sighs> I will sack it in response, and I'll mill you three. Sounds good. Because it's equal to the power, because Notion Steve has a three power. Yep. Island, Mountain mm -hmm. Island. Yeah. Well, I'm going to have no lands soon, because I've <laughs> milled a lot of lands. I'm going to go ahead and play a Reliquary Tower as my land for turn. Tap out. You have three generic mana from that. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and tap Merfolk Looter to draw a card, and then discard a card. Uh, if you do kill both of us, you are going to have to still deal with Joe at some point. I know. I'm just saying. Uh, this is an alliance. You can't break this alliance up. <laughs> you two v two. Your two dock sides really ramped up both of your games. <laughs> That's certainly true. It was a good little goblin. Yeah. Ah, expensive <laughs> goblin. <laughs> he's an expensive goblin. Forty fifty dollar goblin. Ooh, he's fifty now. Yeah. He's like between forty and fifty. Nice. Uh, I do have a discard trigger off the Morphe Pluter. I'm just trying to discard to figure out which of these cards I am discarding. I think it's going to be a Fiery Eyelet, and then I will draw. I'm going to go ahead and use no. two to kill. You hit it with me with it, so that's dying. That's true. Yep. What? It's unblockable. It, what? That one. Kill my, I kill my dog side. My dog side expression. <laughs> yeah, you did his job. Yes. I'm going to go ahead and swing Rael at you, Fran. How big is Rael right now? Rael is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Only oh. seven, three. Seven, three. <sighs> seven damage to my face. Commander damage. That commander. And uh, it hurts. And milling seven. It hurts. Oh, She'll be true. the lightning storm. Or whatever. Making and sure mine crank that will trigger, and you will mill seven. Uh, yeah. Sorry, fellow one, little brother. <laughs> two, three, four. Somebody's got to get milled. Six. Oof. Not just Seven. Nice. No, my hatred. Oh, oh. hatred's a good hatred card. He's a good card. Especially with your, especially your unblockables. Oh, so. uh, generic. I'm gonna go ahead and play a thought vessel. That yeah, makes sense. Now I just like have no maximum hand size. Two different ways. <laughs> Even though you're not close to that. Have... I'm not not close, but it's okay. <laughs> they yep. actually cancel each other out, so you're oh, back to yeah, I'm back to seven. Back. You're right. Two cards. <laughs> uh, yeah, two cards. Sad face. Here we go. All right, I'll untap. I'll upkeep and I'll draw. You need to do something degenerate, that. David. Come on, what you got? You want to see something fun? Degenerate. It's fun. All right. Okay, fun. Demir signet. That's not the fun part. Okay. Mind crank! Wow. Oh my god, do you mind grace? Cranking it up. All right, can we kill one of them? Because no. I don't want to deal with this. I know. I can look for something. I don't know. You know, just because you said that, I'm going to hit you with my 2 with 3 unblockable. Silver blade? Yeah. It's a 2 3. It's a 2 3. Unblockable. 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 Bolt it. Bolt it, I dare you. I don't have a bolt. Should. Uh, I'm going to sacrifice Mind Stone, draw a card. Uh, trigger, deal one damage there. Tap Niv Mizzet, trigger, deal one damage there, draw. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and cycle Sensor, uh, draw a card, and then because I discarded the card, it'll also trigger Rael. So I'll deal one more damage there, and then I'll deal one damage to your face. It'll trigger the Mind Crank. Ugh. Ugh. That's a Misty Rainforest. That hurts. That hurts my feelings. <laughs> well, sometimes you gotta hurt feelings. 
Well, you know, the rest of my turn consists of crying and then passing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm crying for you, especially on the inside. All right, let's untap these sky clay. Oh, don't forget to untap like... that. And then, oh man, my ancient tomb's gonna mill me four. It's crazy. All <laughs> right, but I am gonna gain a life from the Avengers Fair. So let's draw a card. I'll play a mountain for my land for turn. Spicy. Yeah, man, I gotta mill four. All right. You are nowhere close to being milled out right now. You're right, you're right. That's I'm gonna take true. two and I'm gonna mill four. Inspiring I had the Vantage. <laughs> That's Short of Light and Shadow, Balan Wandering Knight, and a Heavenly Blade Master. Not too heavenly right now. I know, he's it's just. in the grave. <laughs> <laughs> two, three, four, uh, five, six, seven. Holy smokes. Eight, nine. You uh, I'm gonna cast like? Triumphant Reckoning. No, you're not. No! Oh, thank goodness, okay. <laughs> Fears Guardians. What does it say though? Wait, but what does Triumphant Reckoning do? Uh, I'm happy we're saying no because it sounds spooky. I don't actually know what it does. Return all artifact, enchantment, and planeswalker cards from our graveyard to the battlefield. We so. don't want that. Oh. Oh, I also forgot my eye. Make another angel. That has to happen. It's not impersonal. No, I hate counter spells. You came in with that. I'm still gonna swing at Lynch. <laughs> <laughs> Strictly business. For four. Strictly business. I'm going to draw a card from the trigger and I'll gain four. Well, in my turn and I'll draw from Monarch. Sadly, I don't interact All with right. enchantments very well. I so. untap, I draw for turn. That makes two of us. I drew a card. I'll mill you again for two. Sure. For drawing to the Sphinx to no, a Plains and a Scalding Turn. Okay. Just I'm going to go ahead and tap for eight. Oof. Here we go. I don't like either of you tapping um, this much mana. This is spooky. I'll play it island for turn. I'll, I'll float a blue nine right. mana. I'm gonna use five of that nine floating to cast Phoenix, God of Deception. He's indestructible. As long as your devotion blue and black is less than seven, he's not a creature. Creatures you control have. Tap a creature, target player put the top X cards of his or her library into the graveyard where X is the creature's toughness. So now my creatures can just tap and then I can target someone to mill. Four floating left but it's all black. So I'll use three of that to cast the clue stone. Yeah, I'll tap in, because you keep hitting me, I'll mill you for two. Sure. Uh, Wyleth, Soul of Steel, Arcane Signet. And I will pass my turn. See, it wasn't that spicy. <sighs> but I, I do my medium hate. Yeah, it was a little, a little medium hate. Yeah. Yeah. I have, this has not been a good start oh. for me. <laughs> this game is not my game. Uh, odds I win, evens I lose. Oh, you won. Yay. No double mind crank. No double mind crank. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and draw a card. Uh, this will trigger Nivizit. Nivizit is gonna deal one damage to Crypt Gas. Yes. Yeah. I, I, I love how you're not talking <laughs> okay. about the guy okay. with 52 life, by the way. Yes. Yeah, well, no, perfect. Crypt Gas needs to die. No, no, it okay. doesn't. Of That's course, the okay. player with okay, 52 okay. life is gonna say that. All right, I will target Akiri. Sure. Says the person with two blue mana open. If I target Akiri, you have to not do anything to this. I won't. I'll play a Volcanic Island. I, I would still be worried about the player with the life race, and he's winning the board race. Wait, with the life race and the board race. The only reason I'm winning the board race is because of the ghosty prison. That's kind of true. And you're still making angels yeah. every That's turn. True. And you have Monarch drawing extra cards. Yeah, with that, or doing nothing because I'm getting countered. A One nine time. spell counter was a very well-timed counter. <laughs> it was a free counter, right. and it was cheats. Well, I'll be honest, I didn't even know what it was. It cost nine mana, it's a non-creature. <laughs> <laughs> Um, okay, I'll go ahead and have one damage on Akiri. I'm gonna cast Narset, Parter of Veils. Oof. So now only we now he can't draw a no, I can't draw extra cards. No, nope. uh, I'm gonna go ahead and flashback Days and or er, Echoes of Eons. What does that do? Uh, you're all gonna shuffle your hands into your libraries and then draw new hands, but you're only gonna draw one. The graveyards, oh. right? Into your library. Right, the graveyards too. Okay. Each player no, shuffles their hand in their graveyard. Yes. Yeah, I don't want to draw anything draw because the Narset's out. Yeah, you only draw one. You draw one card each turn. Oh, my whole uh, milling to Joe went to waste. <laughs> <laughs> I had a counter. Uh, this has... But I told her I wouldn't counter if if she... If she, I go ahead and... She goes after your Akiri. <laughs> <laughs> y'all are diabolical. And now okay. I gotta focus on Narset because I need to draw cards. All so. right, you all can draw one card. I'm gonna go ahead and draw seven cards and have seven of Mizzet triggers. Uh, it's funny. Three, I, three more of those are gonna go at Akiri. I actually draw a card I had my uh, I'm going to pay yeah. uh, one mana. 
I'm gonna unattach uh, Shadow Spear okay. and tap her down, and she gets indestructible until the turn. Uh, sad face. Yeah, sad good. face. And by the way, I have one card in hand, so I don't know how much that Every- Cryptcast. I don't know how much that Cryptcast is. I'm just saying, like, oh, okay. taking apart his board, I feel is more advantageous for you than our. Because uh, he's going to probably kill me with a carry mm-hmm. uh, at some point. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, let's be honest. At like, point. I'm at 12 commander damage. Um, I have one card in hand. Our alliance just, just is board, finished. Just, just <laughs> finished. Just trying to assess board state. Just trying to assess board state presence right now. You, David yeah. and I are not yeah. doing the best. David is doing the worst right now. Um, I'm gonna <laughs> Insert go ahead and, like baby crying noise. <laughs> I'm gonna minus two on Narset to look at the top four cards, pick a non-creature, non-land card from among them and put it into my hand. I, Can you kill two angels so he can't swing at you in the air? Put the rest of my Nimb- bottom in Nimb- her. Nimb- oh, she does have water. Yeah, I do have Nimb- Nimb- it. Did you not <laughs> shuffle your stuff back in? No. Oh. oh. Do you want to yep. draw your one card over again? Because yeah. that's not going to be that different, that's right? That's true, yeah. Well, yeah, I'll just, that that has to happen. Yeah, let's just have him reshovel. Yeah. It's okay. We make mistakes and I hate your deck. That's true. Yeah. We're, this is, this is like, this is like real, real yeah, this is real commander. Real, yeah. You make mistakes, exactly. it happens. It happens. Uh, I'm going to type two colorless and play, is it Signet? Is it? Is it? Is it? Then what? I'm going to tap blue and cast Mystic Remora. The uh, fish? Uh, the fish came back. Cumulative upkeep of one whenever target opponent successfully casts a non-creature spell, I may draw a card. That player may pay four to counter this effect. Kill the fish. What? The fish is on my board. <laughs> so kill the fish. Hey, look at the mind games that David's playing with you right now. Uh, that doesn't make any sense to me, you but okay. Psy- 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 <laughs> the, team, the teenager's trying to mess with your mind. <laughs> Well, how all the mill just it didn't matter at all. At <laughs> all. <laughs> <laughs> Two mill decks that just got unmilled. I think it's smarter okay. to wait and do things on other people's turns, so I'm gonna go ahead and pass to you. That's what we'll do. Come on, David, do something. I all did right. do a lot on my turn. You wanna watch? What it's worth. I'm yes. gonna draw. Then, oh, this is spicy. We're gonna play an <laughs> island. I'm gonna tap four and play Sure Footed Infiltrator. I can tap another untapped rogue, and it can't be blocked this turn. Whenever it deals combat damage to a player, I get to draw a card. I'll pass. Yeah, it's true. All right, let's untap. I'm gonna gain a life. Let's from just give you another angel. Inventor Sphere. I do get another angel. Thank you, thank you. All right, let's tap two. I'll go ahead and re-equip. I see my impending doom. One of my angels. Oh, you're doing an angel this time. Yep. I'm afraid. I feel like everybody's gonna counter me. Uh, I'm gonna tap two to cast my Lightning Greaves, a.k.a. Jordans. <laughs> the spikes. Uh, I'm gonna move to equipped my Jays. Because the one that gives Hexproof? Uh, Shroud. Shroud. And you're targeting who with it? Akiri. I pass priority. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go ahead and tap the Is It Signet for blue and red, cast Is It Charm in response to the equip uh, with the mode of draw two cards, then discard two cards. So I'm gonna draw two cards. Uh, and then I'm gonna discard uh, Island and an Ox of Agonis. Uh, this will give me, and then I'll trigger it. This draw two from the discard two because it's the first time that I've discarded this turn. And then I'll have four Niv-Mizzet triggers, and I'm gonna throw four triggers at Akiri. Sure. She will die. Finally. All right. So I. And then will, you get another chance to equip. So go I for will it. Try to, I will equip my Lightning Greaves to my Angel. The 4-4. Four, four. My 4-4. Four, four. You know, I'd like to see an angel. That's a lot of money you're talking about tapping. Oh, two. and would you like to pay for Mr. Grimoire? Sorry. Oh, no. You, okay, you, then oh. I'll draw and I'll throw the trigger on one of the angel that has the... Sh- is the one that has the shadow, shadow spear, spear on it different from the one that has the lightning greaves on yes. it? Yes. Yeah. The one that has the shadow spear on it will have one damage from it. Sure. <laughs> um, okay. So come say, come say. I'll tap the ancient tomb. I'll take two damage. Mill I'll four. four. <laughs> Planes. <laughs> Mistress Workshop. Again. Cigar Zade and Shram, Senior Ed Pfizer. 5 6. For an Archon of Coronation. Uh, when Archon of Coronation enters the battlefield, you become the monarch. <laughs> I just really like the monarch. Uh, <laughs> as long as you are the monarch, damage doesn't cause you to lose life. Uh, Wait, what? That card's a little too scary. I'm going to go ahead and force a little oh, oh, that oh. pitching brain. Hey. It does not. <laughs> it's Maybe a scary Yoda. boy. Cute art and a that scary is a card. Cool. Yes, it's, 
It's very cute art for I think it's card. trying to be cute to not make it less scary. Yep. Or I'm taking one damage, milling two for each of the two different. Mind there cranks. we go. I uh, will mill Tormenting Voice and Cascade Blast. Where it's like, bam. See, blue is not a strong color. Um, <laughs> not at all. Go to combat. Okay. I, I mean, if I'm going to take, if you're going to trade with me with Niv Mizzet, that's cool. Uh, I'm going to send uh, both angels. If you let me keep Narsa, I'll kill the Crypt Ghast. No, I don't care anymore. Okay, Our alliance good. is done. That sounds good. <laughs> That's fair. I'm, I'm coming at Narset with uh, both my angels. Narset's dead. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, you really wanted that Narset gone. Well, if she blocked, then the only one gets through, so. But then she dies she either way, so there's exactly. no point yeah, in blocking. Yeah, this one has lifelink. Yeah, oh, still blocked. Shadow though. Sphere. One, two, yeah. three, four, Do you five. really need new music? Yes! <laughs> Do you? Yeah! All right, cool. So what are you doing and after that? Second go man? My, go to my instep, and no. I, I actually get to draw for the monarch. So I will draw. And I will pass the turn. Okay, I will untap. Uh, in your untap step. Yep. I'm gonna tap Merfolk Looter to draw a card and then discard a card. I'm gonna discard Talisman of Creativity because of Rael. I will draw a card from the discard. This gives me two Nymphs of Triggers and I will do two damage, attempt to deal two damage to Crypt Gas. Right, I'll tap in response, and I will mill you two. Sack I will also two. sack him to Alter Dementia and mill you another two. Okay. I will discard Desolate Lighthouse, Hole Breacher, Misty Rainforest, and Scalding Tarn. All the And then I will draw a card, and I will mill you two again for the Tutelage, which yes. I'm not going to forget this time. I've been forgetting <laughs> this trigger all game. I'll mill Shark Typhoon and Electro Dominance. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Okay, we're all bad at magic. All right, now I'm going to play a Drowned <laughs> Catacomb. Uh, which does not come in tap because I control a swamp or an island, which I have both. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I can't tap him, you know. <sighs> trying to keep I'm, everyone from I'm, digging. I'm, I'm going to pass. On your end step, I'm going to tap niv Mizzet to draw a card. Uh, this will give me a niv Mizzet trigger. I will deal one damage this away so that you can uh, get some cards in your graveyard because you're the only one without cards in your graveyard right now. You're a jerk. <laughs> you're Bitter hitting a 14 year old. Yeah, you're hitting a child. <laughs> How why, could why you? Why'd you have to mail two? One. One. Opponent my trigger. bad. Right. You're good, David. You're good. You're still learning. You're young. Uh, go to my turn. Mana Crypt. Uh, Come on. Odds I win, <laughs> evens I lose. Even! <laughs> no, four. Uh, yeah. We did start. I mill, I mill three twice. Six. Yeah, so six. So yeah. six. Oh, six. Yes. Command Tower, Fierce Guardianship, yes. Arid Mesa, Windfall, Mystical Tutor. Sorry, one, two, three, four, five. Okay. And Mountain. And then. There mountain. we go, David. We're at least doing some mill work. The drop return. Uh, this will give me a Niv Mizzet trigger. I mean. I'm going to do one damage to your face. Sure. Is that anywhere. acceptable? That's 55 fine. life. I'll take one. I'll mill two. I'll mill Nahiri. Hair of the Ancients, and a Grim Monolith. Mill that stuff. <laughs> I did? <laughs> I'm just trying to say I did something, okay? At least I did something this game. We tried. Yep, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and it. play an Island as my land for turn, tap Fire Diamond, and cast Gamble. Ooh. Good. Yeah. Blue players at the table. If I do, what are you gonna do for me? I'll stop hitting you. I'll kill you last. Look at me last? Yeah. All right, I'll pay three and I'll, I'll thought collapse. Ooh. Counter war. Uh, I'm gonna cast four bid with buyback of discard two cards. What That's a great say? card, Rayo. It's yeah. on the stack. I'm gonna discard lonely sandbar and mountain. Uh, trigger Rayo, draw two, and I'm gonna attempt to forbid thought collapse. What does it do? It says no. counter target spell, but the buyback, and it'll go back to my hand, mm -hmm. and I'll draw two because I discarded two and right okay, triggers. Cool, cool, cool. I think that resolves. Cool. Yeah. I will draw two for bid. We'll go back to my hand. The only reason why hand. I didn't draw a card earlier was I had to All right, Gamble's good. Gamble's good. Gamble's good. good. Yeah, if you can win, take us out. Yeah, all right. Who's picking the card at random in my Me. hand to discard? All right, yes. sounds good. I called it. I choose this Narset. Narset, flip it over. Spellseeker. Ooh. Ooh, that's a nice Spellseeker. It's, it's a good card. Foil. Judge oh. promo. Judge promo. Uh, but you did not find the uh, Curiosity card, oh. which I am yeah. going to attach to uh, yep. Niv-Mizzet. 
and um, go ahead and machine start gun the table. machine gunning everybody down. Pew, 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 pew. So Curiosity says Enchant Creature. Whenever Enchanted Creature deals combat damage to an opponent, I may draw a card. Uh, niv Mizzet can also tap to draw a card, which will start it. And then every single time I draw a card, I'll deal the damage because of niv Mizzet's ability. So I can deal a total of, if you would like me to count how many cards are in my yeah, deck. Sure. Yeah, because sure. he has 55 Because he has 55 and life, so it is totally possible that... Yeah, that you uh, don't have enough. You would need a total of 114 to kill us all. Look at that math, the big brains on Brad. Check out the big brain on Brad. <laughs> Where's that from? <laughs> from Pope Fish? <laughs> huh? Oh, yeah. yeah. 7, 48, 49, 50, 51. Oh! So I can't actually kill you, but you don't, so you don't have a flying creature in play, correct? Uh, I'm not able to block. No, he's not tapped. Able to block. And I do have enough mana to attack you. All right, I mean, Through wanna... Ghostly Prison. I can kill these two this turn, and I don't think I'm. You have no cards in hand. I don't have any cards in hand. No, I have no cards. Okay. So you're not gonna kill him right now? No, I am gonna kill him right now. One, two. If you hit him for fifty, three, he will be done because we have two mind two, creeps. Three. Never mind. Uh, I would like to do that. Okay. I have a Thassa's Oracle in my deck. Okay. So I mill. And on my devotion, you're gonna mill basic Thassa's Oracle. If you, if I, you'll let me look to find it. Yeah, to yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> So right, well, you drew, way, so she, she drew 50 cards. I'm drawing 50 cards. There's one card left in my deck, and if it's the And she's doing 50 cool, damage to you. Do I even have anything to shuffle? And before? then if she's doing 50 damage to you, that means you're going to mill 100 I'm cards. I'm going to see if I have any Eldrazi in here. I don't think I do. Or anything that shuffles back in. I do think that the Thassa's Oracle is the last card. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it's, I do also have Lab Maniac. So, there you go. And so then, you're good. Yeah, you're covered. So I have Lab Maniac and Jace. Uh, Wielder of Mysteries and Thassa's Oracle, so I will win the game when I have no cards left. Oh, my Thassa's Oracle. Yeah. I was thinking of Thassa's yeah. Intervention. Either one and then you draw, then you get the Monarch. Yeah. Then I do get the Monarch! Because you swing with Nim is it? Yes. What a super fun game. So then she kills you, so hold on. <laughs> <laughs> let's, no, let's, no, least, okay. let's least finish the my entire thing. My entire deck is, I or one card is left. Uh, so my entire deck so is first, in my oh, hand. So first he went to... He did He's going to go to 55. Go to 55. So I hit... So I hit, so so hit, you you hit, hit him for 50. 50. for 50. I'm milling you 100 cards yep. because of the two mine cranks. Which milled. Boom. And then I'm going to attack you for to four. down to one. I don't yeah. have any more to mill. And then I'm going to take the monarch. She has the monarch. Uh, before my end step, I'm going to cast Thassa's Oracle. Uh, my devotion to blue is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, I get to scry, and if the number that I scry is more than the cards left in my library, which is one, I will win the game. Boom. So, Fine. well, I hate your deck. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I just hate blue in general. So I hate all three of y'all yeah, decks. Yeah, sorry you had to play against three blue decks. <laughs> yep, but <laughs> my nightmare. That's what Jill loves. She just wakes up. He just wakes sweats, up, and I just want to play blue. Well, thanks for coming on. Yes, I hate your deck. <laughs> It, we had a good time, yeah. and David, thanks for coming out. You know, I'm glad it was President's <laughs> Day, so you you could be out of school, <laughs> participate with the grown-ups. Hey guys, thank you so much for coming out and watching. I hate your deck. I hope you like, subscribe, and comment below. And if there's a deck you want to see on I Hate Your Deck, please let us know in the comments. Yeah, yeah. To help us keep generating content, every little bit helps. Feel free to join our Patreon where you'll have access to upcoming episodes coming out, join our Discord, and much more. What's up, guys? We want to send a special shout out to all of our sponsors. Shout out to Carsphere, where you can buy, sell, and trade MTG cards. And shout out to Dragon Shield that has the best sleeves. And we got our custom sleeves right here, and perfect fits, and deck boxes, and play mats. <laughs> also, shout out to Alter Sleeve. They will hook you up, definitely. If you want to bling out that deck, hit up altersleeve.com. We'd like to thank Heidi Ho for being a sponsor of this month's game of I Hate Your Deck. Thank you for letting us play some paper magic and letting us get some games in. Always support your local LGS. It's time for the Patreon shout outs. I'd like to thank David Disney, Bailey Yankee, Bob the Builder, and Warren McCullough. Thank you guys for being our Tier 3 and Tier 4 patrons. We give shout outs to both our Tier 3 and Tier 4 patrons. And for those that don't know, our Tier 4 patrons every month get a custom sleeve from Alter Sleeves. It's something that me and Joe work with an artist together to bring you something special. So thanks to all the patrons. But one of the benefits is we give these special random shout outs. Thank you guys for supporting us. We really appreciate it. Your support is what helps us continue to be able to make this content possible. And we look forward to keep getting better every episode.
Thank you guys. Also, we got those new playmats, y'all. So make sure you go on the website. Shout out to our new playmats, our new shirts, our new merchandise. Make sure y'all look at all that going on. Intro and outro music by Hollow Brooks. Background music by Sakura. I hate your deck. <laughs>